hiyo tunatengeza sisi ni wakulima na tunazival ikiwa raw materials tunakuwa tunazivalu ili kuongeza thamani mimi nikiwa mmoja wa kusimamia wale wakulima wote na mimi nikiwa mmoja kama mkulima kama mwenye kuzival pia niko o ya upande wa raw materials na tukipeleka fikira zetu kwa value addition tukiona tukifanya ule utafiti wetu wa kitaalamu tunaona pesa pesa kubwa sana ama nyingi ziko andra a value addition raw materials tukizalisha sisi ni wazalishaji after tuzalishe tukajiona sisi hatuwezi ku export kule nje ina maana tuweze sambaza sehemu nyingine na tulifanya hivyo o, ilimu tukawapea tukawapata mbegu pia zinatoka andra kibuyuni saa hii nafikiri kuna kituo kingine ambacho pia nafikiri kitakuwa cha sasa tuko na vituo kumi ambacho tuliweza kupeleka after mimi nikipata kipande niko na nia hiki kipande hiki kwa mfano nikipata soko ni nini itani support kwa export kule nje inabidi mimi nijitume niseme licha hiki kipande nimepata pia o ni sambazie wenzangu ili ku export kunahitaji o hakuhitaji mtu mmoja hiyo tulifanya kama andra kibuyoni lakini shida shida iko ni ku export shida iko ni marketing hata tukaketi tukajiuliza muda kama hivi kwa mfano o, tunajipeleka kwenye IMTA ile ni kitu nikiangazia itanufaisha pakubwa sana o, community lakini after tujiulize after tunatoka kwa IMTA na tuki ikiwa imeboreka imeboreshwa imeboreka itahitaji marketing wapi tutakuwa na marketing watafiti wanahitaji kuingia pia waangalie pande zote so pande ule wasiwi tuki o, tukizalisha hiyo ikiwa raw materials alafu yake tukona iko na shida marketing ni shida kutafuta marketing na kuchukua raw materials after wiki o, o, tuseme wiki mbi, wi, mi, miaka miwili yule mnunuzi ameenda bado wakulima wanasema licha hizi tutazichoma mimi nawatuliza licheni tusichome licha tuangaikie marketing tulipoangaikia mpaka 2022 tukakuwa sisi ni other cooperative tulipoingia kwa cooperative amini na naona ni kama wakulima sasa tumetulia saa hii shida na kutafuta marketing na marketing zinapatikana kule Zanzibar ni kama Kenya haijafungua ama haija fanya research ya kuyakina ya kuona kama hii seed ni, ni, ni biashara kubwa ama ni kitu ambayo inamsimamia community na industry industry Kenya hakuna industry ya seed ndio maana marketing nafikiri inakosekana mm, industry zinapatikana kule Zanzibar hiyo ndio sana inasaidia na sisi si kibuni peke yetu ni sehemu zote ambazo wenzetu tuliwapea hiyo knowledge ya pia waweze faidika kama sisi kina mama lakini marketing sasa tukoona wapi tujipanue wapi mtu kama na hizo raw materials tuweze jipanua pia aweze kufanya mambo yake ni kukua na value addition hapa value addition hapa kunahitaji marketing ya hali ya juu saa hii sisi kama other cooperative saa hii tunajisaidia sisi tusaidie wakulima tununue cooperative ndio nunue za wakulima ndio sasa ikiweka pale wapi wata export wapi watapata marketing ya kuuza ili uirudishe pesa waweze kusaidia wakulima ni sisi wakulima hatukupata usaidizi wowote after saa hii tumeingilia ndani kama sisi wana mama tukujikutakuta hivi kama tumeacha nyuma lakini tuweze kujipamua japo hatujapata knowledge ya kwa sisi vipi tutawekwa pamoja tuwe na kina baba saa hii vile vyenye tumejipamua tumefikia mahali Mungu alete rehema zake tutaweza kuexport kule nje sisi 
wa mama ni kama tuliachwa nyuma lakini kwa saa hii huruma za watafiti na wale mashirika mengine tuweze mujaribu pia wana mama sisi mtuweze kutupa kutupea knowledge ili mama mama anaweza muda ukimwezesha mama anaweza na mama atafanya jambo akuwe sawa sawa na baba marketing ni kitu sugu lakini otherwise hakuna hiyo hakuna otherwise inabidi wa mama tujipamue tuweze kusaidia maisha yetu na vijana wetu asante hii inaitwa market trend alafu cha pili kuna hiyo market strategy na hizi zote wakati tunazileta pale kwanza mpaka tuangalie production nafikiri nyinyi kama watu ambao mnohusika na huu mradi pamoja na siwi mbali na kwamba wewe utatoka hapa alafu wewe upo na sabuni zako kumi alafu sabuni zinabaki pale pale nafikiri kuna njia ambazo tunaweza tukafanya zile product za hawa kina mama wakapata so lakini swali kubwa hapa ni production kwa mfano hizi sabuni hazijaingia na kumati sidhani kama sijaingia and then tuko na supermarket nyingi sana hapa Kenya kwa hivyo kwanza soko lipo mama Fatuma lakini shida sasa ni ule mtu wa kufanya linkage ya zile product kuingia pale sokoni alafu wakati before tuingie katika masuala ya linkage pia kuna swali la quality na quantity na standards na swali la standards nafikiri zile sabuni ziko na Kenya Bureau of Standards chapa yake kwa pale lakini nafikiria pia ile standard yanazozungumzia director pale inaweza kuwa ni standard nyingine sasa ya ile quality yenyewe ile kitu ile kile kwa hivyo tuki compile vitu vyote vikiwa pamoja na vikiwa sawa nafikiria itawezekana zile sabuni kupata soko nyingi pengine hiyo soko hata inaweza ikawashinda kwa sababu leo kwa mfano na kama tisem yani kana contract na kibuni si wili farmers nataka sabuni 1000 kila baada ya wiki ye yeah. ile cost of ile uwezo ku produce sabuni 1000 huko yeah, sasa kama hauko tunafanyaje kwa sababu ukiandikiana contract na mtu yeah. ina ile contract na kwa legal binder yeah. uki breach ile contract unaweza kushtakiwa mm. tena leo vizuri eh? kwa hivyo ni kitu ambacho tukae kama washikadao nikisema tukae kwamba sisi tuko bahari na nyinyi wenzetu wenzetu uko ule pande mwingine tuangalie vipi ambavyo tunaweza ku tafuta ile tufanye ile cost of production tukiweka hizo resources ziko sawa cost of production iende juu quality iwe sawa alafu sasa ile jukumu la kuwatuka nyinyi soko tuangalie sasa in that way nafikiri tutakuwa tumeimprove sana hata tutatengeneza ajira zitakuwa nyingi pale kiburudi na raw materials kiingia pale zitakuwa zinauzwa kwa wingi alafu pesa sasa zitakuwa zinaingia direct na indirect na hiyo nafikiri itainua hata hali ya uchumi ya ile sehemu ya kiburudi hiyo asante hybrid local plus formal so that with the formalization of our operations we are able to bring in experts uh, we are able to bring in various key stakeholders one of them being expert and specialist in areas of that technology you to me on mambo ya sensor day sensor day came to after colgate and clover and today it's very much competitive because they brought in an expert who could do a testimony that is what two kule petu tulikuwa na mradi wa Narek na uko hapa pia kwa na tukafanya kitu inaitwa show CSK show lakini show this project kama inaweza ikatafuta njia ya publicity publicity just as a project and you know you can attract a lot of attention all the way to Lam all the way to Tana River huko ndiko kuna bahari sasa kama hapa itakuwa inaonekana kwamba umekuwa na uzito kupokea new technologies we could do a, an exchange program along the way to kuonyesha kwamba hizi changamoto zetu hapa sisi tumezi overrate wengine they have circumvented them 
and they have come out very successful. That is one. Two. Three, as a self-organizing group, have we engaged, including technologies even in marketing, because we have Facebook, we have Twitter, we have all these various methods of doing marketing. Now the case, like my brother did allude to, is it is the case of a chicken and the hen, the egg and the chicken. What comes first? Do we need the, chick, the hen or do we need the egg? So, muna tafuta so, je, muna weza kukalito sheleza. Sasa wezi kutengeneza so, kama huja tengeneza vitu. Kwanza vitu vipatikani, tutafute soko. Lakini kama tutafuta soko, ndiyo turudi sasa tengeneze vitu. By the time tunaenda soko, ni mtu mungina mechukua ilo soko. Thank you. We had a life claim. Professor Menzel, we 30 to 50 meters away from the shore. Nazima hapa kuna maji ambayo wanikina mtu wanaingia ndani. Kwa kijana wetu bahati mbaya alifunga misumari, vyuma, nyundo, akajaribu kuogelea na akaenda for good. Kwa hivyo this time kabla hamja kalia ule mradi kutuletea kule mashinani, mjipange na chomo ambacho. Najua leo utaenda. Mimi nitabaki hapa leo fuoni. Kuna maintenance nataka nafanye. Utakuwa ukiangalia ile cage. So mimi niweze kuwa na chomo kita nipele kwa cage. Nwezi kuangale ule mradi, unaendelea jisio. Mimi nikate shaudi la kuenda kumbe na riski, na kuwa tumi istoli ya mda mrefu. Saiza yuwezi tutoka kichwani, kule nukua kumbukumbu kama hizi. Sante sana. On the issue of meeting the market. Ok, chati tunaidengu kuzaikuwa kuna ilo swala la, la kutafuta soko. Maybe kitu ingina mbo chumbiongesea pia ni swala la, access to finance because um, the communities need to know who are who na financial packages gani hapo into financial packages in forms of who na kama mashirika inyaneza pia na loans ama grants ndogo ndogo wakati wameza kuonyesha kuwa um, mishumuli gani ambazo kwa wenye kwa wenye wanafanya na um, wangependa to supply kitu flani, 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 kitu kama hizo. And then, something else, uh, kuna issues na, um, after sasa tumewambia kuwa kuna hizi na 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 hizi. Then, tunayaza jaribu in terms of now, linking them up na hizo financial institutions. Yeah? Creating those um, interactions na hao, wangalia kama, Tunaweza kupata some form of partnerships na wawo. Tumisuma hapa, kuzingatia kwa mbamba, tunafundishwa mbinu mpya, ambazo ni za kisasa ambazo zinakuja, kwa sabu tunatumia mbinu za zamani, lakini hizi ambazo tumetuleta hapa ni mbinu mpya, ama mfumo mwingine. Lakini kifikiria sana mbamba, katika masumu haya, ya natuelekeza maali ambapo, tunataka, kupenya ndani ya tundu ya sindano hili. Hii na maisha kwa mba ni mahali papia mbapo lazima tuwe makini. Na kuwa kwetu makini ni kwa mba tutekeleze yale ambayo yatakayole yatakayole yato. Kwa sabu tulikuwa na wazimaji wanasima tulikuwa na analogia. Sa hii tunenda na digital. Analogia yetu mbamba kule tumefundishwa ule mimi ni mkulima mwani. Tumefundishwa mwani vizuri sana. Tukaelewa vizuri sana. Hata sayi mi hata kama nimefunga macho hivi nita kuambia mwani nafunga hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi. Ukija usiku sasa saba nita kufunisha mwani. Lakini hii mbini naleto sasa siyo hati ufunge macho. Nuhue very careful. Na kuwa careful ni kwamba lazima tuzingatie macho yetu na askili zetu. Tujue kuna hii IMTA. Inachanganyo na vitu ambavyo. Tushajaribu kweli tuchanganya samaki na mwani. Bado. Ndiyo mwanzo. 
ndio sasa sasa hapa ndio tunaleta pamoja ni kama vile tumeambua sasa tumefanya gendering tumetukua kina mama na kina baba tumewashanganya ndio hawa samaki na mwani sasa hivi ndio tutakufanya sasa kwa hivi basi lazima tuwe makini alafu kwa kwetu makini ni kwamba hawa ambao wanatufadhili sisi ama hawa ambao wana wameamua kutufundisha ama hii project ambayo imesimamia sisi kutufanya kutuendeleza ni kwamba nayo pia iwe makini kwa sababu unaiona hii chupa paka iwe chupa unajua imefanya imeanza mbali eh? imeanza mbali kwa hivyo isiwe chupa tu ikawa ni chupa tu kila mmoja anayepiga mateke tukija anayepiga mateke ah tunataka hii chupa ithaminiwe wakati kama imefanywa nini imekuwa chupa hii inamaanisha kwamba sisi tumeletwa hapa kama community nasema upande wa community kwa sababu sisi tumekuja kufundishwa hapa isiwe tunarudi kule nyumbani alafu tufika kule nyumbani kule kwa tumetulia tu hivi yani tunasikiza kina madam dorcas na kina joel waje tena waje watusukume tena wewe vipi wana ile mta unaijua ama hujui itakuwa si tumecheza tumecheza ile inaitwaje zero work si ndivyo kwa hivyo basi huu mfumo tunaojua hapa tunaofundishwa hapa tuwe makini nao alafu kuna mahali maki umesikia sasa hii unaona pale pale nyuma ule mfumo tuliofundishwa na kina na temple zamani ilikuwa mama hawafiki kwa maji mengi lakini mfumo sasa unapeleka mama aende wapi? Aende kwa maji mengi ambapo mama hajui hata kuogelea. Umesikia? Hapo pia kuna changamoto. Mama pia hajui kuogelea lakini atapeleka. Maana yake ilikuwa ni pale chini kibuni, sasa ataenda kule kunaitwa karibu na mpunguti kule, karibu na pale. Ndiko tutapandwa mwani sasa. Ama si ama kule nini mwipwa. Ndio kutaenda kupandwa mwani sasa hii. Sasa mama anaenda kwa anagedegadega kwenye kidau. Sasa hapo ndio pana kazi. Kwa hivyo basi Nyinyi ambao mnasimamia ambao mnaeleta huu mfumo ama nyinyi ambao tunafanya tunataka kufanya hii project lazima tuwe makini na pia kuwe na viegezo vyake kwamba hawa watu kweli tutawafundisha hii mbinu mpya lakini tujue sasa watu wakifundishwa hii mbinu mpya watafikaje maji maji mengi watapitia vipi watafanya nini ili kuwawezesha wakija tu madam dorka akija namba we Fatuma yuko si kule ngoje paka aje Umenisikia vizuri Nimesema fumbo fumbo lakini mtu anajua aelewe. Nimesema fumbo fumbo lakini kuelewa kwangu ni kwamba lazima tuende na njia sahihi. Otherwise tutakuwa tu, tumefundishwa na tutakuwa tukali tubaki vile vile kama kama vile vile watu wa amani ama vile vile community. Hii inamaanisha kwamba tusiwe watu tu wa kufanyishwa kuonyeshwa jambo tulafu tukaliachilia mkono. Lazima kila kitu kifuatiliwe. Ufuatiliji ufuatiliaji huu uwepo na nyinyi ambao mnasimamia pia nanyi mfuatilie mpaka the end of the project. At least tuwe tumeona tumeenda mbele ama tumerudi ama tuko hapa katikati.